And hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Portal Runner. Last episode we defeated the Great Tree, and in this episode we need to defeat the dragon in order to gain access to Bridget's castle. So let's jump into this and try and do this. First off, let's just dodge all the stuff. Interesting. So there's shields that Vicky is pointing out to us. Sounds like we need to get it. We obviously Leo is nowhere to be seen. Let's just grab these um gems because they're quite easy to grab by the looks of things. And they're quite good gems on top of that. So I'm not sure is the dragon going to like just randomly appear places? Like around this entire moat? Or is he determined? Is he preset? I like how Leo is just like just sitting there like, yeah you got this, Vicky. And that dragon has a lot of health. <coughs> oh, pardon me. Apologies. Oh, hey, that's actually a... A tricky one to grab. <coughs> oh yeah, he's taking me. He's, he's doing some damage on me. Right, where's the shields? That she was mentioning. Ah. I think to hit these. Oh, yes we do. Let's hit all of them. Right, okay. That is doing stuff, but oof, that was um <laughs> Mist has risen. And I'm doing I'm I'm taking a lot of damage. That was not worth it. That was a lot. That was not worth it. Grab all that. Grab lo all the health. And suddenly I'm okay again. Oh, hey. Hey, man. Using basic arrows on this guy is like trying to take out a tank with a day. Yeah. Yeah, this guy's uh, kind of messing me up right here, right now. And I. Freaking died because I tried to be smart. Damn it! I tried to be smart and I lost all of that. God damn! Right, no more being smart. Let's just defeat this asshole. Just grab these gems, it's a really easy to grab. Please. Oh crap! Probably should leave. I forget that these golden hearts only give you one. The green hearts are so much better. Can't believe how I died. Yeah, we definitely want to chill out here with the green hearts. Screw the gold hearts. The gold hearts just suck. Oh! And we can use these things as cover as well. Which is even more good. Right, okay, so now I believe the way we need to, oh yeah, these platforms are gonna take us to the stuff we need. Come on. I don't have all day. Definitely don't have all day now. But thankfully, oh no, that green heart didn't respawn. Right, I want though that that looks like an explosive arrow. I want one explosive arrow to take. Oh my god, this guy's gonna kill me. I'm dead. The only way I'm not dead is if these green hearts have respawned and they have, yes, well, the one has. Right, I have an explosive, so now I just need to wait for this asshole to pop up. And completely miss. Like, completely and utterly miss. Let's 
Is he gonna pop up here? Yes, he is. And I'm so nearly dead, this is not even funny. This is actually kind of tough. But you can predict where he's going to turn up. And water arrows do a crap ton of damage to him. Right, I literally have no health. So I'm going to be using this as cover. While I wait for health to respawn, yes, thank you, health. The water arrows did the most damage, if I recall. So I'm gonna go for these. Boss isn't too bad so far. So far it's not that bad. I can deal with this boss I think for now. Just need to know where he's gonna pop up next. Right there. That, did that do nothing? I feel like that did nothing. Right. Oh, for God's sake, right. Let's go for the trident arrows I guess. Oh god, he's right there. Well, he's at half health. We are making progress. Frick. Alright guys, I have found the way to do this. You essentially need to just pop out. You need to wait until he fires. Fire, pop. Fire, pop. Fire, pop. That's essentially the routine you want to go down. So we're going to grab these trident missiles. Trident missiles. Trident arrows, we're gonna grab these and get back. This is obviously the most dangerous part because you're the most exposed. So just get behind cover as quick as you can. Oh, I pushed the wrong button. Twice, I pushed the wrong button twice. He's nearly dead though. He is nearly dead. Where's he coming from? Right, we're gonna go for these. We're gonna go for the water arrows. Yeah, uh, because these, I'm, I'm convinced these water arrows do the most damage to him. Where's he coming? Oh, he's coming up all the way over there. So he's really in a good position. Oh, he's so close to being dead. So close. Let me wait until he disappears and then I'll grab that explosive. Where is he? Oh, he's over there. Alright, so we're just going to wait until his attack cycle is done. In fact, no, I'm just going to actually just... Right, we're going to go for it. We just need this explosive and then he is done. I missed! Frick. And you have to re... Like, 
something I learned is you have to turn these like things back on. Like once you collect them, they will they will go off. So you have you have to re-hit them with basic arrows. Right. Okay. Let's go. Not missing this. Right. Okay. This is gonna. We're pretty much gonna have it finished now. This is it. Victory is mine. We are the Dragon Slayer. So that was a, a kind of toughish boss to, boss to figure out. But once you had it clocked, it's not that bad. So let's see. I could have done way better on that level. With gems and stuff, but oh well. You know, Hawk, we may have had our differences in the past, but I never meant to hurt you. I don't think you understand how much I care for you. I love you, Sergeant Hawk. All I wish is to hear that you love me too. Where's Vicky? Ah, enough of this madness. See if you can make him change his mind. You know, she is certainly not as beautiful as I. What? This is not possible! Rage! How did Vicky escape from the dinosaur world? And how did she come into contact with a lion? <laughs> A lion, uh, my queen? Yes! A lion! I put you in charge of securing her, and now she has escaped! She will ruin everything! I've been right here, my queen. Negotiating terms with the Martians as you requested. Fool! Go to the castle and make sure they don't cause any more trouble. I want them captured. Do you hear me? Yes, my queen. Good. I will deal with the Martians myself. Collect the magical playing cards to open the doors into the castle. Interesting. I need to get inside the castle. By the way, we are more than halfway finished this game. Of hearts. Find the Ace of Hearts card to open the Ace of Hearts doors. Right, but we're gonna be doing all that kind of jazz next episode. So, and there's four cards by those things. So, thank you guys. Oh, and 164 gems. That tells me this is a big level. So thank you guys for watching this episode of Portal Runner. I hope you have enjoyed. If you have enjoyed, please consider leaving a like, subscribe to my channel, and leave me a comment. And as always, it was a pleasure having you here. Hope you're well. And I hope to see you next time. Take care, guys, and I'll see you then.